Let's go back to the phone line, talk to James in Inglewood, California. Hi, James. Okay, how you doing, Hank? I'm doing well, thank you. That's good, good to hear. Listen, I got a question. I want to ask you uh, if the um, Ten Commandments come from pagan religions. Well, no. I mean, all truth is God's truth. So if you find within pagan religions one of the Ten Commandments, like thou shalt not murder, uh, that is something that we intuitively know is wrong. Again, all truth is God's truth. But if you look at the Ten Commandments, there are one half of the Decalogue attributed to worshiping God rightly, and the other half to dealing with your neighbor as you should. And this is precisely why the Apostle Paul in Romans chapter 13 says there's actually only one rule, and that is to love your neighbor as yourself. Love does no harm to its neighbor, therefore love is the fulfillment of the law. And of course, what uh, Paul is saying there is if you love your neighbor rightly, it means or presupposes that you love God. Or as Jesus says, love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul, with all your mind. This is the first and greatest commandment, and the second is like it. Love your neighbor as yourself. All the law, all the prophets hang on these two commandments. So Jesus is summarizing Ten Commandments as two, and Paul later on takes all of it and summarizes it as one. Uh Uh-huh. Okay. That sounds good, honey. Well, thank you for your question. And by the way, for those that do not know the Ten Commandments, the Ten Commandments are simply that you should have no other gods before Yahweh, the God who spoke and the universe leapt into existence. And you shall not make for yourself an image in the form of anything in heaven above or on the earth beneath or in the waters below. You shall not bow down to them, nor shall you worship them. You shall not misuse the name of the Lord your God. You should remember the Sabbath day, keeping it holy. Honor your father and your mother. You shall not murder. You shall not commit adultery. You shall not steal. You shall not give false testimony. And you should not covet. Explicated in greater detail, if you look at the commandments as they're given to us in the book of Exodus.